Now their cameras are the very first in history to film in this inhospitable landscape. And they capture rare footage of an elusive deep ocean hunter. Nobody really knows anything about them. Their common name is Assfish and Robustus. Not, not a great name. Not a great name. If you look at it, it's got its double nostril here. So it's got massive nostrils. So it doesn't care about the bait. What it knows is where it can smell bait, it's going to be an accumulation of articles. So it just turns up and just picks them off. Once a crowd of the shrimp-like scavengers arrive, it's dinner time. Then, from one of the darkest, most remote parts of the planet, comes the rarest of creatures, a Dumbo octopus. Remarkably, it's the deepest octopus ever filmed, by almost 6,000 feet. Its tentacles are joined together by a web of skin to form an umbrella-like body. And the huge ear-like fins that give the Dumbo its name help to make it an extremely agile swimmer. It's waiting for the bait to lure its favorite meal. An unsuspecting deep-sea crustacean is moving across the seabed. In such a pitch-black home, the Dumbo's eyes are virtually sightless. Instead, it uses sensors in its tentacles to pinpoint its prey. Quite often what octopus do is they'll sit on top of a crustacean and they'll bore a hole through it at the back of its uh, shell and they'll inject it with saliva and it dissolves the, the shrimp, for example, from the inside and then it sucks out. That's disgusting. Nice. The probes have brought back remarkable images from the deep. 